Dad is driving me mad. Banging on about these golf lessons his little darlings have him. All right, so you've come all the way over here to tell me that? Nah, um, he wants you to work a shift tonight. You could have just text me. Ah, but as I pointed out, that's a waste of money, as you only live on the road, so I thought I'd come and ask you myself, thereby appealing to his natural tight-fistedness. All right, so brownie points for you. Yeah, and an extra ten minutes on the sky, so stick kettle on, will you? <laughs> I was going to be late. That's right, blame me. <laughs> hello. Well, hello. Amber, what are you doing here? Never mind her. What's he doing here? Don't be so rude, Sophie. Jeff's our guest. Um, make yourself a brew or get yourself some breakfast and uh, I'll see you later. That's great. Bye. Bye. So, how do you like your eggs? I'd better be getting off. Really? So soon? So what's with the face? You missing Sean or is it about your mum's new boyfriend moving in? Look, he's not moving in. Not yet, maybe. But first it's the fancy restaurants and the flowers. He'll leave it out. Then the staying over weekends. And next, he'll be asking you to call him dad. Amber, I know how to use this. <laughs> Get any work done. Oh, yeah, what do you think I'm doing with this? Giving myself a spray tan? Hey, what's of your cheek? I'm still annoyed with how rude you were to Jeff this morning. Yeah. Just please. Well, I don't see why you're still seeing that creep. I mean, you and my dad was getting along fine. Well, my love life is none of your business. Um, hello, you, my mum. Yeah, and you best remember that. When I found out about you and Sean, I supported you, didn't I? Eventually, yeah? Oh, do you know what, Sophie? I'm not in the mood for this. Let me make it dead simple for you. My house, my rules. If you don't like it, you know what you can do. Why me? Never knew she was such a moody cow. I can see where you get it from now. Oh, yeah. <laughs> you sounded really upset. I'm more than that. I'm fuming. Bro? Yeah, well, like I say, you sounded really upset. Who's isn't the answer? But it'll do under the circumstances. <laughs> what do you want? I thought you'd be at work. Making him a sandwich, is that okay with you? No, it's not, actually. I'd appreciate a bit of privacy in my own house. Yeah, tell me about it. I know the feeling. I had it this morning when he traipsed down the stairs. Come on, Sophie, we'll go to the cafe. No, we won't. So you've allowed your new boyfriend around, but I'm not allowed my own dad? Look, so why don't we go over the pub? I'm not making myself scarce to suit him. No one wants a row. Oh, don't you believe it. I am bang in the mood. Why? What's happened? <sighs> Doesn't concern you. Come on, Jeff. let's go to the rovers. We can't keep dropping in like this, Kevin. It makes things awkward for everybody. If she says I'm bad, I'm bad. No, she didn't say you was bad. You know what I mean, Ian? I can't just keep dropping in. Yeah, well, this is so stupid. Uh, what's this? Dad can't just pop in anymore. Dad, it is your house. You need to put your foot down. Look, I'm not going to rock the boat if that's the way she feels. Dad, man up, for God's sake. Look, I appreciate your support, don't get me wrong. But the fact is, your mum's moved on. I wish no, she had a... Dad, she hasn't moved on. She thinks she's moved on. Well, whatever. Things have changed. I'm going to get used to it. Eileen's got a guy around and she told Jason to get out of the way and it's all my dear. Oh, Sophie, don't worry about Grandad. He's getting better every day. It's not my Grandad I'm worried about, it's my dad. Yeah, well, maybe he's right. <sighs> Mum's moved on and we just have to accept that. Yeah, well, I thought they was getting back together. Yeah, me too. So why does she always have to put a stop to it? Well, she can't forgive him, I suppose. What more does he have to do to, I don't know, make it up to her? Well, maybe there's some things she can't make up for. Look, it is him that she wants, not that stupid Jeff bloke. Yeah, but if Dad wants to be happy, he's not going to force it, is he? Rosa, can you imagine Jeff as our stepdad? Oh, oh don't. But anyway, you'll be leaving home soon and it won't be your problem. Uh, yeah, but it'll still bother me. Yeah, bothers me too.